New York is a place where people come to have their dreams realized. That's why so many people not only come to the city, but ultimately make their way to Tiffany. Do I know how to give good <laughs> bites or yeah. what? The engagement ring, as we know it, was introduced by Tiffany. The branding, that blue box with a white ribbon, is unequivocal. <laughs> no choice of color has ever been so successful in the history of marketing. People that have very positive associations with it. Oh I can see it from the other side of the room. That's Tiffany. We've obviously pushed the boundaries. This is not going to be your everyday blue book. We did a lot of wreaths in the past, but the beauty about this piece is that they're pear-shaped diamonds going in one direction. It's fun, but it is intense because it's not to be taken lightly. Especially when people will come to Blue Book and they will see some of the pieces that she wore at the Oscars. The one celebrity who will always be associated with the brand is Audrey Hepburn. She makes for the perfect Demi Moore. A good girl doing bad things. Holly go lightly. Think about it. Well, the first time I saw Breakfast at Tiffany's, it didn't cross my mind that she was a prostitute. There are certain people who know the secrets of Tiffany. Tiffany designed that interlocking in why for the Yankees. Here we have about, I'd say, over $20 million worth of diamonds. I want something that I feel amazing in. At the end of the day, the dress is easily knocked off. The jewelry is priceless, and people know that jeweler. There are a few American retail outlets that are true institutions. Tiffany's 7-Eleven. Hey guys, did you know that Pierce Brosnan was contractually forbidden from wearing a full tuxedo in any non-James Bond movie from 1995 to 2002? For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. But if you want something else, click on the playlist.